on that matter. Cameron Vonnemere joins us from the newsroom this evening for a preview of tonight's special report, Cameron. Thanks, Bob. A little more than three months have passed since Missouri voters approved Amendment 2 to legalize the use of marijuana for certain medical conditions. Now, thus far in 2019, the state has already received more than $2 million worth of pre-filing applications for those looking to dispense, cultivate, or potentially use marijuana. Now, as other key dates in Missouri's medical marijuana timeline approach, the question of what the future holds for marijuana businesses, patients, and the city is being asked. Now, I sat down with a local politician and a physician who are voicing their opinions on Amendment 2 and its potential impact on the community. Because of the jobs and the revenue that medical marijuana will create, we have an obligation, a duty to the people of St. Joseph to make St. Joseph, Missouri the most medical marijuana friendly city in the state of Missouri. I don't have any problem with the concept. Uh, I think it's going to be very hard for these substances to stay in the hands of the people who are supposed to have them. Now watch us tonight at 9 and 10 for the full report on how our local officials and physicians are viewing medical marijuana. Back to you guys.